if everybody wanted. Usain Bolt, two-time champion. Justin Gatlin ran the two fastest times in the world. Didn't end up being quite as close as some people might have hoped. Gatlin couldn't do it. What happened in that race? I think we saw classic Usain Bolt showing up like he always does in the big races every single world championships. I think we could have seen a little bit more from Justin there. Uh, he dug deep and I don't think it was all there for him. He was looking for something that wasn't there and finished in a slower time than he ran in the U.S. trials six weeks ago. Right, almost a full tenth of a second slower. He did not look like himself this final 30 minutes. And the one thing he brought up, and we both had kind of the same reaction, he came out and one of the first things he talked about was the short turnaround between the semis and the finals. It was about an hour and ten minutes. Uh, he said that he really felt he couldn't get his strength back. What was your reaction when he first said that? Initially, I was incredulous. I mean, this is the Olympic finals. I mean, you could run in five more minutes and you got to go. However, then Usain Bolt came out and said, I was tired too. Usain Bolt called the turnaround ridiculous and stupid. So there was that. Uh, however, there was another factor that I think probably weighed him down. Uh, Justin Gatlin got tremendously booed twice before the start of the final, and that's got to hurt. He was even booed before the semifinal. And after the race, we tried to talk about what tunnel vision he had. He also said, look, you hear everything. You just try to tune it out. Uh, it's hard to imagine that didn't affect him to some degree. Uh, but then he also said that being the oldest man at 34 ever to take a podium in 100 meters was a victory in itself. Is that a fair assessment? I think it's a bit of a shallow victory there. You want to win. The guy wants to win. He's a competitor. He wanted to beat Usain Bolt. This is not the Usain Bolt from 2008 or 12. He's slower. He's older. He's towards the end of his career. So this was Justin Gatlin's last chance to dethrone the king, and he didn't do it. No, he's got another chance against him in the 200, but Bolt said he was more confident in this than he was going into any other race. Kind of a fearsome prospect. Two more events for you, so you both to try to do that triple, triple that no one's ever done before.